hi you guys we are back again with another tutorial today i'm going to be demonstrating this quick weed pixie cut some of my clips are missing from the beginning but i have already went over how i lay down my tracks stretch my tracks mold down my clients i will link all of the videos in the description box so that you can go back and see it but i am going to be listing the hair that i'm using for this this video is a video that i filmed um last year and I found it so I thought that I would go ahead and upload it for you guys for any of you that have any further questions about how to lay down these 27 piece tracks and I have a lot of you that ask me about why do I lay my tracks down underneath the hairline I do this so that the track doesn't flip up as time go by you want your client to be able to get the longevity out of these quick weaves y'all know back in the day how the tracks used to flip up but when you lay it like this I found out that it does lay down longer I will leave this video in real time a lot of my videos I do speed them up because the process is so repetitive but I'm going to leave this one in real time for you guys so that you guys can see exactly what I'm doing so I'm going to mention the hair that I'm using I'm using Indian Tyra 27 piece hair and I'll trade doobie feather 6 inch they do not make that anymore at the time when I filmed this video they were making it like I said this was like over a year ago when I filmed this video so I converted over to using the velvet Tyra 246 so any of my videos now where you see that I'm using the velvet Tyra that's what I converted to using and you can find that at any one of your beauty supply stores Please make sure that you like, comment, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Leave all of your feedback in the comment section below. And I will make sure that I get back with you guys if you have any questions. For the sideburns, all I do is cut a tiny piece and put on the side and make sure that whenever you do this, put at least one or two tracks for your sideburn area. And you will do the same thing on the other side this is a better view of how I do this and it's very, very close like I said I'm doing this in real time so that you guys can see exactly what I'm doing around the perimeter of the head the hair is left out and I do this for a reason so that it doesn't lift up but I do before I molded her down I did go in with my diamond my Roberts diamond protective shield to make sure that you're protecting your clients edges
joint.
loin. What?